Welcome back to the channel everybody. Uh, today is uh, day six of my bike trip north to Isan in central Thailand. Uh, I'm in Wapi Patum. I'm just heading out to uh, my friend's farm. Uh, the first day we spent a fair bit of time at a friend of hers farm strangely they both have the same name <laughs> and uh, yeah had something to eat and just had a look around at the farm and uh, then later on in the evening uh, went out with some family for uh, food which was absolutely fantastic uh, we went out for food in a place called Ban Pai which is where I stayed in the armor apartments in the previous video so please uh, enjoy the video and uh, I hope you uh, are enjoying me taking you along with me on this journey. Uh, that's what it is. There's nothing sensational, nothing spectacular. There's no bar girls. There's no bars. Uh, there's no pataya. But uh, it's just my journey. A trip north. And um, I hope you enjoy taking the journey with me. I just wanted to take you along with me. So please enjoy, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, it doesn't cost anything, just a couple of minutes of your time. Share the videos around, uh, that really helps me build the channel, which is what I want to do. And uh, enjoy, here we go, let's have a look at Wapi Patum. Yeah, so just stopped here for a coffee on the way to Maha Sarakam. This is a beautiful little spot to sit and have a coffee on, on a road trip. It's nice and shady. It's kind of like a little Japanese garden. You know, I'm sure a lot of people stop here. There's some Thai people here at the moment doing the selfies. Thai people love selfies. This is a pretty, pretty spot. I've had my coffee gonna hit the road again soon this is just beautiful check it out what a lovely little spot what a lovely little service center to stop and have a coffee on the trip just beautiful absolutely beautiful Whoever does this garden and looks after this garden is an amazing human being. Check it out. And of course, you know, you've got the little selfie corner in here where all the Thai people stop and do their selfies. Selfie corner. Little Japanese garden. Sawadi Kaap. Sawadi Kaap. Sawadi Sunyu Pai Mati Nai Sunyu Pai Mati Nai Buriram Buriram Oh Pai Macha Am Yeah, so a lovely little stop to place to stop
out in the country. This is real countryside. Up in Hisan, at the back of Mahasarakam. The woman owns this farm and works the whole thing by herself. She's got about 20 cows, grows rice, that's a new dam. Just then they get fish and uh, shellfish. Big, big mango tree. Loads of flowers, it's gonna have heaps of fruit. All the rice husks, stalk. I don't know for bedding for the cows or for food or what. Hammock for the hot day when you're tired. These people work so hard, so hard, day in, day out, every day. Cook your smoke over here. It's a real Thai country living. Real Thai country living. It's nice here in the shade. I'm telling you, it's really hot. The organic smells here are amazing. The cows, the cows, you, the food, the cow food. Really is an amazing place. Really amazing. This is young corn, yeah? Corn? Corn, ni? Corn. Corn, ni? Grass for cows. Oh, just special grass for cows. So they grow this quite a few kilometers from here, load it all in the truck, bring it back here for the cows for food. Uh, put it through the grinder here. And it comes out like that. And they feed it to the cows in the trough there. Absolutely beautiful place. Absolutely beautiful. I'd love to come here when it's uh, the rice season, when the whole place is green. Right now the rice season is finished. It's the dry season, the start of the dry season now here. The rain's finished, everything's brown. It's very dry. Oh, now I'm not sure what this is. It's some kind of oven. And I'm not sure what they cook in there. If they just burn, um, if they just burn uh, rubbish there or if they cook something or what, I don't know. I'll find out about that for you. For me too. A big clay bakery. I wonder if they cook bread or something in there. I don't know. Quite a few of her cows here on the, uh, have got calves and quite a few of them are pregnant and they'll get sold off. This is uh, a field that's just been planted out with corn, which is to feed the cows. Mm. Amazing place. It's just beautiful up here. It's hot, but there's a breeze actually. There's a nice breeze. It's nice in the shade. Really, really, really nice place. I love it up here. It's just beautiful. This is real rural Thailand. Yeah, I'm so happy I got up here. Really amazing. Cool breeze, it's beautiful. <laughs> Work so hard every day and just laughing all the time. Tamaya, oven. Oven, fine. Alaini. For uh, we need for fire for cooking for make chicken chicken like. Cooking, make bread, thing like this in there, yeah, yeah. So it is an oven. It is an oven. Uh uh. Yeah, kau cai, kau cai. Must be lunchtime, making lunch on the farm. Tama Lai Pi. Thank you. 
food for the cows through the mulcher. Got it up here. I think this is uh, guinea grass or something like that. I think that's what it's called, guinea grass. Very good for the cows. Mulch it up and make it like chaff. God, I love this place. It's magic here, it's just so beautiful being here. I mean, it's a hard life for these people, but you know, you can understand why they're always so happy and always smiling. What a place to be. You couldn't want to work in a better place. Even though it's really hot today, it's cool here in the shade next to the water. They eat the fish out of the dam, they eat the food that they grow on the farm. Yeah. Just magic. And we've got a fishing net here really for getting the fish in the dam there. Really magic place. Love it. Fish trap. Everything here from the farm. Everything. So you're working on the farm, and while you're working on the farm, well, except for the sticky rice, <laughs> you're working on the farm, and you just go and pick the stuff and make the food. You couldn't want any fresher or healthier. Absolutely amazing. I love this place. <laughs>